To start this video off, it's just a video of me talking about something more on the serious side. I want to make more videos like these. It's not going to be any editing because I'm a lazy cunt. And also, it's just more of a down-to-earth type thing. But for the love of God, don't look at this video as like a commentary channel. I mean, I know it's essentially a commentary, but it's like actual things that I feel are important. I know YouTubers just say shit like that, but these are things I think I could help people in my audience or things that aren't ever talked about and should be talked about. This isn't me just going like, okay, I need a video topic. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make something about uh, Agario porn. Fat white woman walking across street look how fat she is but anyways this is about edgy memer kids well not particularly edgy a lot of them tend to be edgy because of the way they act but kids that are like completely drenched in this whole irony everything's a joke persona i'm never serious at all it's funny type thing and when you're younger online it's funny and even now i can still find it funny not that i'm like 80 years old i think it's a more balanced type of thing and that's how a lot of things i'm going to talk about in general are just it's a balance you can't be too much of one thing because if you are you'll fuck yourself over and then you'll create new problems for you. But anyways, these edgy memer kids, they don't take anything seriously. They make fun of people that do take things seriously. And everything's always a joke with them. But something, and I can relate with this, so I'm not trying to belittle people that are like this, because I was like you too. It's just, I, I'm older, so I know more now. Or at least I think I've matured, or just got sick of shit, but... It will, you'll eventually get to a point, even right now, if you're young enough, you don't think you will. You will get to a point where you're like, Hey, I actually have emotions and feelings, and I'm a real person. Mm -hmm. Shit. Because that's what happens when you get older, I think. Or at least you become a moody little bitchy teen. Whatever the reason, sometimes you want to express yourself or be taken seriously, and you can't. And for a lot of years, you'll be unable to. You'll physically be unable to. Because all you do is drench yourself in jokes and making fun of other people. So you don't have actual time to build upon yourself. And I've heard this from so many different people because I've experienced this with a lot of people. That they're like, I never have conversations like these. And it's usually a serious deep conversation. And it's... Well, it doesn't have to be that way. If you're still young and you don't want to fuck yourself for when you're like 18 or 17 when you start actually caring about this shit or even 16, don't always present yourself and just drown yourself in jokes and memes not taking anything seriously because even that can subconsciously fuck you over. Unless, if you're fine with that. I mean, hey, maybe you're okay, maybe you're cool with that. But also, don't be completely 100% serious all the time, because those people are also fucking annoying. I know it's the whole centrist meme, but you really just need a balance. And that's something I want to talk about a lot, because I feel like a lot of people are like, I have this criticism against myself, I need to completely do the opposite. But if you do the opposite, you're most likely going to create another problem down the line that you could be avoided if you just try to balance it out and try not to be too much of one thing. Don't always be extremely hilarious and funny all the time if you want to be taken seriously, but also don't always be serious to the point where people don't ever want to talk to you. Don't always be extremely negative all the time because you'll be a buzzkill, but also don't always be extremely positive because it's fake as shit. Just a balance, bro. Balance, dude. I mainly made this video because I know this can go out to a lot of my edgier, younger fans or people in my audience, and hopefully they can take away something from this in the case of the future they're like, well, why isn't anyone on Discord online with all my online friends taking me seriously? That might be why. You just have to go about it the right way. I think one of the reasons why so many people online tend to act this way is that a lot of the people they look up to, whether that's online influencers or YouTubers, TikTok people, things like that, they always present themselves as like a joking persona or something that isn't actually genuinely them. Which is understandable because that's how a lot of people come across. Like, I'm sure if I make a bunch of edgy videos, everyone's going to assume, Oh my god, he he's a racist bigot who hates everyone. Um, uh, yeah. And a lot of people do do that and it's fucking annoying. But it's understandable, even though it should it's not right at all. But impressionable kids online take this and make it completely them because they're never serious. When you're younger, you don't... You're never, you're never serious until you reach a point where you are, but you can't ever be serious because of the whole joking thing. It's really not that deep. This video isn't that deep, but I see a lot of people in my audience that just joke around over fucking everything. And it's like, these are the same people that say, I've never had these deep conversations. This is why. Take it from, take it from your boy. I know the tone of this video sounds kind of edgy, especially with the music in the background, but I literally cannot be fucked to edit. I don't even want to get better music. This is what you get. You just know there's going to be joking replies in the comments that basically are the same exact people I'm talking about in this video. I'm warning you, bitch. <laughs> I'm warning you. Even now, I know people aren't going to take me seriously because all I ever talked about was just jokes and shit. So when I actually make a serious video, they're probably going to be like, eh, I don't want to watch this. Fuck that. Let me know if you just want to see more videos of me basically talking with no editing. But on serious shit, I'm not going to talk about baby peanut meme. Yeah.